Welcome back on my channel. As always, I'm really excited to record another video for you. But before we start, I have to remind you that you always invest in your own responsibility and you should do your own research. As you can see, today we are on the main website of bread, the base bread, and I am more than sure that every one of you have already heard about this project since it was established in 2024 and it made a huge boom over the last few months. However, if we somehow have a person who haven't heard about base bread, it is a meme inspired ERC20 token built on base, so the Ethereum's layer 2 chain. It is named after the Pepe's friend and as I said earlier, it was launched in 2024 with no pre-mines or founder allocations, fostering a fair community driven ethos. It operates within DeFi and meme coin culture with active community engagement and several related dApps on base. However, this is the community that drives this project. On the very top, it still has so many fans and so many investors. And this is a true power of this project. Just take a look at its Twitter. We have 152,000 followers, so that's just crazy. And we also have those amazing posts, memes, animations with bread, which are added frequently. We also have many interactions, so that just shows the community engagement in this project. One of crypto's most significant cultural icons and the mascot of base chain. Well, I can't disagree. As you saw, they have huge base of followers on social media all over the internet. So that's just true. What can I say? Here you also have their address. You can buy the tokens on OKX. Here you have a little tutorial and it is featured on so many pages, so many websites, whether these are the futures trading or the exchanges. We just have a huge base of platforms where bread is present. The tokenomics model is very simple. We have 85% LP, 10% treasury and 5% CEX wallet. And that is it. Then the utilities that you just can't deny. We have strong partnerships. So that's what we saw a second ago. They have huge partnerships that help them ensure the long term viability and growth. And that's exactly what's happening. We also have growing ecosystem that is rapidly expanding. And also thanks to that, the base chain, the whole base chain continues to grow. And that will also make bread thrive and last but not least the strong community support that is as i said the whole foundation of the project and it is the people the followers who actually made it so successful and now let me take you to the dx screener uh, to take a look at the charts and how the situation is looking for bread right now all right, so first things first, the market cap is currently $432 million with 24 hour trading volume from 40 to 57 million. So this amount of trading volume is actually healthy, but what I want to focus on is the price since we had a little drop compared to even yesterday to also around 8% drop over the past week. When we take a look at the trading view indicators, the short and also the midterm signals lean to the neutral to sell. And when it comes to medium to long term outlook, we might have a bullish moving average structure. But we still have to remember that the recent decline in Brett's price has been largely driven by the broader downturn in the market. And such widespread market corrections tend to impact even strong projects just like Brett. 
which unfortunately has seen a drop of the price of approximately 45 over the past month. And at this stage, it is possible that the token has reached a local bottom, but there is not yet enough confirmation to indicate a clear trend reversal. We definitely have to observe the charts and also the coming days will be critical because we will see how the situation will develop. And if we see that the price holds current support levels and begins forming higher lows, it could signal that the start of recovery phase is here. So I would say that the project is definitely not dying. It is still very alive in the social media presence, all of the charts, um, but we have to be cautious. We have to observe how the situation develops. So for today, this will be it. If you like this video, don't forget to leave a thumb up and subscription to support my channel. And I will see you in the next video.